going to make something very easy today and I'm going to use some store-bought pasta sauce and some parmesan, an egg, and breadcrumbs, a small piece of veal, and some salt, and some Munster cheese. Let's get started. I'm grating up a little bit of parmesan in this bowl here. And I'm going to mix that in with my breadcrumbs. Take that and mix it in with my breadcrumbs. I kind of like half and half. It's like what I like. And I may do just a little more. I think I will. And I also want to do some more parmesan on this side so I have little sticks. Here's my small piece of veal. I'm just going to cook for me. And I'm going to put some salt on there. Kosher salt. And I'm it's tender but I'm going to go ahead and pound it. a little bit and cut it in two to make two pieces. I have some flour and here's my breadcrumbs. Where's my egg? There it is. Here's my egg. And I'm going to take it and put it in the flour real quick. To the egg. And the breadcrumbs, which I made way too many. It's okay, I can use them for some chicken or something. Take it. Really press these, try and press the crumbs into it. And I'm going to put it on a plate here. And I like to let this sit in the refrigerator for oh 15 minutes to just it'll help glue the crumbs on there. And I'm going to do this to the other piece as well. And then put this in the fridge. My pan's been heating up. I'm going to put some olive oil in here. I want to coat the bottom of a pan. We'll add our veal to it. I just want to pretty much gently cook these. It's been about a minute, a minute and a half. I'm going to turn them over. Just brown them on the other side. Yeah, it's been about two minutes. So I'm going to put them in this pie plate. Put just a little bit of sauce or as much as you like on here. Spread that around a bit. Or put no sauce on there whatsoever. Parmesan. And the Munster. Make sure it's covered. Then I'm going to put this underneath my broiler in the oven. Took about two minutes under the broiler. And there's one serving. I like to, myself, I love sauce. So I like some extra sauce that I can dip it into. Top off with a little bit of parsley. I 
I also like to have some bread and a salad, some salad to go with it. And I highly recommend it. It's very good. Thanks so much for watching.